and start. <clears throat> hey folks, it's Grimwit. Uh, this is Gary's Mod. So I'm going to do something I don't do. Um, I'm going to chase a trend. Uh, in fact, it's partly because as SCP-1471, it's my duty to lurk in the background of all photography. And nothing is more photographic than uh, analog horror. So anyway, Kane Pixels updated today. <clears throat> today? This will probably come out the same day. Uh, Kane Pixels updated today. And so did uh, GM underscore BR underscore pitfalls, which was meant to be a backrooms version uh, from the version from Kane Pixel's work. This is not like the full thing, but it's, it's close enough. So we're going to explore this shit. Now, I've already explored this, but it updated today. It added the threshold. Yeah, I've been told that there's a lot of detail in this, and you know I love detail. Uh, yeah, like, is that... Is that a normal asset? I'm not... Hmm. So I backtracked a little bit. Um, the threshold is that doorway you see in Kane Pixel's thingy. The, the start of the back rooms. Because we're, we're getting deep into back rooms lore. The back rooms is sort of interesting, right? It's not, not sort of. It's really interesting. Uh, there I am in my spooky womanly ways um the backrooms is very similar to slenderman in that it's pure internet fiction one person did not come up with the backrooms what am i hearing oh i'm hearing a radio what does this say? I have an accident. Uh, heavy duty radio received signal discrepancy around lateral division D. Possibility of other signal zones around the complex. Potentially valuable assets for both future expeditions and understanding the complex. Okay, I'm, I'm at full. Uh, I'm, what is the complex? Fuck. Uh, radio is stuck playing same music. We'll fix it tomorrow. How are you going to fix it? It's an anomaly. How are you going to fix this, SCP? You can't fix this! Uh... Nobody... Can, can, can you pick me out or line up? Nobody saw anything. Uh, let's see here. Continuing on down the road. Is this the women's room? No, there is no women's room. There's just the men's bathroom and that's it. Wait, actually, I didn't actually see. Is there... There isn't anything saying this isn't anything. Ooh, async. Compromise the death of information. Uh, compromise is the death of innovation. Wow. That is dark, if you think about it. Um, they are so with it at async that they, uh, they fucking keep their digital uh, blueprints of circuitry in the fucking bathroom. That's some corporate bullshit right there, if you ask me. Let's get into this. We have yet to even get to the threshold. There's so much fucking detail. I love it. Uh, oh, okay. That is that is clearly the threshold. Let's not start there. Let's just keep moving. Hey? Huh? Where's, where's the phone? Where's the phone? Where's the fucking phone? Yes? Where is it? What? Where's the phone? Hello? Where's the... Okay. I didn't even get a chance to, like, set my reaction or anything. Fucking hell. I gotta get better on, on my emotes. God damn it! Where's the goddamn phone? I don't even... I can't answer it! Is there a phone around here? All right, I'm just going to ignore it. Uh, this is a server, some kind of server room. Oh, what do we got here? Nothing I can read. 
Ditto. Okay, let's let's get rolling. Uh, I I already have my my awesome self. God, fucking phone! I can't answer you. Oh, that's hmm. That's uh, that's no good right there. That that could lead to some injuries. Y yeah, May maybe don't go. Maybe don't go near that. I'm really pissed off that the phone doesn't answer. So I got a question for you. Uh, I've seen cars and stuff go into the back rooms. I'm sure we'll actually come across some cars and a lot of equipment. And uh, yeah, this is the threshold. This is definitely the threshold. Let's let's go willy nilly with the controls. Um. So cars and equipment and stuff, and they have a thing over here that's big enough to open up, like in case you need to like get some transportation materials. How does it get through this door? Um, does this actually say anything? Uh, not, not much. ML, ML. We have some cameras. Peekaboo, SCP here. It's your boy, SCP, here to give you another spooky adventure. Oh, I'm all spooky. Fear me. Woo ha Um, hmm. I wonder if there's a way to, like, set off the alarm. Maybe not. Well, it is time to get into the back rooms proper, and there be a little bit of an issue. Um... So when I uh, when I visited this uh, map a long time ago, it, I was already in the back rooms and everything made sense because I, I knew where everything was. Now I don't know the layout, so it's proper back rooms experience. Let's uh, let's go running, I guess. Or I could you, you know well, hmm, 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 hang on, hang on. if we're going through the back rooms, let's go in style. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. It's a Reliant, by the way. Yeah, I don't know if you've seen Top Gear. Uh, the Reliant uh, wrecks, like, super easy. It's a three-wheel vehicle with the front wheel. The steering wheel, that is, as the front wheel. Uh, as as the uh, the main front, the only one wheel, right? So, it, it's it's really well known for its um, handling difficulties, uh, uh, but at least it has power difficulties, and uh, it's also real pretty compared to vomit. Anyway, it's a good car. It's a, it's a proper SCP car. I feel like if any car had some kind of weird um, anomalies, it would be the Reliant. Mm -hmm. You're doing good. Going through the back rooms in style. Ooh, that looks fancy as AF. Let's go down the creepy area back then. Uh, do my headlights work? No. Okay, this might be, like, turned off for now. Or maybe it just doesn't allow cars. I don't know. I 
bet I can pull this off. Let's not go down that way. That way is stupid. Any entities around here? Big titty SCP coming your way. Oh, hey. I recognize this area from the show. When there a Spoopy. All right. I didn't see Trench. Wait, wait, I was, uh, I don't, I don't think I got turned around. What? What the f did? Wait. Okay, okay, I'm good. Um, we're looking for the pitfalls. That area should be brand new. Oh, uh, bacteria entity stuff. Do I recognize this room? I've seen all of, uh, all of the backrooms from King Pixel, so... Alright, uh, let's tell stories, everybody, um, in classic, uh, backrooms fashion, I'm lost. Uh, this is actually, if anybody's seen my channel for any length of time, uh, they know that my sense of direction in video games is shit. So, uh, I was kind of doomed from the start, in all honesty. I've, uh, whoa. Freeman? Froman? I, I, uh, yeah, this, this might take me a little bit. I refuse to edit this down. You're just going to have to fast forward. This looks familiar so far. I mean, there's familiar and then there's whatever this is. Oh, what about you? What? Oh, okay. I found the threshold again. So, yeah, I made it back to the beginning. That to win. Uh, hmm. Hmm. No! Oh! This looks interesting. And this also looks familiar from the last time I visited the map. So if I kind of hug-ish the left wall, or the right-hand wall, I should come across the, uh, the pitfall area. Uh, oh, uh, this, this, this is new. Um, hmm. This is new. All right, well, let's keep moving. Oh, 
Oh, holy shit! It's the the scene where Trench killed Mark. Think we can find the map? Uh, the map was on a pillar. I'm trying to remember, man. I'm trying to remember. Yeah? He hmm. Uh, is there a dead body around here? So you, you recall that they kind of fessed up and said, Oh yeah, Trench, he's, we said he was dead. And then he wasn't dead. And that's because we said he was dead, but he actually wasn't. We, he just disappeared. And then he appeared again. And we didn't know what to do because we said he was dead. And now he's not dead. And then, like, he's dead again. So we're just going to act like that didn't happen. But also, Mark is dead now, and what are we going to tell his family? <laughs> Maybe we'll say Mark is dead, and then by the magic of the back rooms, he won't be dead again, and we'll be in another mess. Hell yeah! How did this get into the building? How did we get this in here? How did we squeeze it into that tiny door? I'll tell you how. Whoa, what? What? Uh, zero point manipulator. Say, wait a second. This wasn't in Kane Pixel's work. Let's start fucking with shit. Yep. Don't mind me. Actually, you know what? We can finally get over here to see whatever it was that uh, the guy saw that, you know, everything else could wait. Oh, it's a green light and a dead end. I've been here before. Uh, but as always, I get a little turned around. Let's jump down a hole. Yeah. Oh, cool. Let's jump down this hole. Yeah. Yeah, tuck and roll, bitch. What do we got over here? So, uh, I I've seen this area. Chances are good that I've seen all the areas the pitfalls have to offer. There's really only one area, right? Oh! Oh, that was close. There's really only one area we're interested in, right? The, the red neighborhood area. Where that's not a person. That's not a person at all happened. Here's some rope. That's good. Uh, nice, nice BDSM materials. We can hide in here from the entity. Boo, I'm an SCP. And let's keep moving. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Empty fucking room that you can fill with whatever you want. That's what async offers. Empty fucking rooms. Ow. Okay, this is actually the inside of a hotel. Right. And it's been used over and over again because it's so alarming to our, our brain space that they have an outdoor court indoor. Right. And I've seen a couple of maps that mimic this hotel, like the actual hotel design, only with some kind of spooky bullshit going on. Like, oh, look, a shadow, nah. There we go. That's said they give me a way out. Ooh, what's down here? Ooh, what's down here? That's generally what the back rooms is to me. Like, I'm supposed to be afraid and shit, but... I can't be, man. I can't be. It's it's just it's just another ooh what's down here game. I'm not scared of the back rooms. Like, yeah, I'll die. That sucks, but I'm going to have a blast exploring while I die. 
Ooh, what's in here? Ooh, laundry. That's that's generally my feeling. Uh, anything in here? Nope. And you gotta wonder what what they did, right? What did they? What did you do, async? What did you do? How did you make like fractal office space? How did you make this fractal office space? Why did it turn out like this? What have you done? Oh, it's a bathroom. See, it's a, it's always like the under when when I was making the liminal. Uh, oh, I don't know how much I should say. Suffice to say that for one particular video game, I was making a top-down liminal map for things, and we were talking about what does it mean for liminal space. And they, we, we came to two, two things for the mood, right? Two themes for the mood of a liminal space while we were making those maps. Because I was, I was doing... I don't do 3D stuff, right? I just do 2D. One is that it looks like people just got up and left an hour ago. Like, it's empty, but people just got up and left the place an hour ago. Oh, that's fucking spooky as shit. So that's the first thing, right? The second thing, it looks like it was created by an AI that knows what a door is, but doesn't know... Like, knows how a door should be placed, but doesn't know what a door is. That's the best way. Like, you, it knows, okay, uh, uh, there are multi-floor levels, right? It knows that, the, the AI does, but it doesn't know why. It's just kind of mimicking shit. I think, you know? This is the one with the girl, right? The girl went through this area while running from the entity. Which means we should be... Yep, there it is. And we've seen this car crash. I'll slow down for a second. There's the handprint. That's really low. It must have been crawling. So the AI says to itself, Closet, we need one. But what is it? Like, how does it work? Why is it there? Or it'll say to itself, Bedroom. E every, every office space needs a bedroom. Bedrooms have beds in it, right? Yeah, I'm going to look in there. Pixel's been leaving... Oh, I don't like that. That's, uh... Mm, black mold is really hard to get out of the walls. That's fucking creepy. Good job on... Who made this map? You know, hang on a sec. Pitfall, 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 pitfall. Just give me a second. Here we go. Who made pitfall? Slim bottom blow. Slim bottom blow. S C H L I M B O D I M B L O. Cool. Yeah, that, that totally gets a thumbs up for me. So, uh, good job on him for making this just creepy and disgusting, and I appreciate it. Um, and it matches perfect right down to the. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Right down to the um, the painting. And Pixel has left some clues as to what's going on with the painting, right? Like the painting came from something. Hypothesis. Uh, Async showed an AI what a bunch of photos of places are. And the AI just extrapolated from that what they wanted. It's a pity they can only do this like a couple of times, right? I, I, don't, I don't know the mechanics of it. Also, I'm getting really fucking lost. Um... I don't know if I can even make it to the threshold again. I'm, yeah, fuck, I'm getting very lost. Let me take this direction real quick. 
Okay, this, yeah, I just saw that. Pretty sure this is one way to go. No? Uh, left, right. I'd like to end the video by finding that really awesome room with the thing. Whoa! Did somebody go through this? Oh, gallery. Okay. Ah, uh, no, no joke. That's legitimately unnerving. Hmm. That might be about a cup of maybe two and a half cups of doom. Let's not do that. Crack in the wall. Okay, okay, I recognize this area. And uh, I want to ask the... Is it still here? It is not. Okay, okay. I was going to ask the... Uh, God, that's such a good... The guy who made the map, if he ever watches this. Last time I was here, there was a metal ball down this particular hallway with no explanation. And I would pick it up and walk around with it and it would be my friend. You know how people have pet rocks? I had a pet metal ball. I kind of am curious if he ever if he ever sees this video, uh, Shamblo, please leave a comment explaining what the deal was with the metal ball that was so bizarre. Uh hmm. Hmm. Oh, all right, I'll jump down. Actually, I think this will kill me, and that'll be okay because I need to restart because I'm, I'm really lost. I bounced. Let's see here. Bop, 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 bop. Yes, I am pick... Oh! Holy shit, that scared me. All right, we're good. We're good. Everything's fine. Nothing's wrong. Oh man, I'm I'm made of manliness and testosterone. I can handle these things. I, I'm not scared. You're scared. Yeah. All right. Let's see if I can remember easily how to get this. Right, it's you, you vaguely hug the right wall, you take a right at these pillars, you jump past the uh, the, the trench kills Mark uh, hallway. It was Mark, right? So, I'm betting you it's one of these two pits, is the one that, uh, well, I guess I'm about to find out. Hey, I picked right. Yep, I picked right. See, this, this, this is excellent. Uh, that's definitely like the, the, the AI says, hey, you know what, you know what, rooms need pillars. Rooms need pillars. Give me a second, I need to take a sip of my tea. Rooms need pillars. And I don't know what a pillar is, but I know rooms like 80, 81% of rooms like this have pillars. So I need to make sure that it has a pillar when I make this room. This is weirdly how AI works, right? AI works in that, you know what? 5% of rooms have hallways, but 2% of rooms like bend this way like a fun house. And since there is such a thing as a fun house and there's a hallway and an exit, just with these percentages, they all kind of make this Venn diagram of fine. Let's make a twisty hallway that leads outdoors like a fun house. 
Right, that's how the AI thinks. It doesn't know what this is all for. It just knows that it is. Ah! Ah, that hurt my head. Ooh. That's the heat. I've been here before, but they've changed it. Uh, it's way different. He opened up the skybox. But... And added sound effects that freak me the fuck out. Cool. I'm, d I'm done with this. This is fine. Nothing's wrong. Ever. Forever. Yeah, yeah, we'll go down that house first. I want to... Can I... Can I die here? Nope, nope. This is a solid black wall. Hello? I'd like to spread the, the gospel. Have you heard the good word of our Lord and Savior Dagon? And or John Wick? Legitimate. This area is fucking legitimate. It's more legitimate than you are. Admit it. This is amazing. This is more legitimate than the guy who made the map. This is amazing. I love this. I fucking love this. Hmm. I don't think I can break this window. Uh, backward signs. We got them. Weird ass funky hallway. Okay, this is a styling, styling backpack. I would feel pretty hoity toity in this backpack. I would feel pretty good. And entity here. Let's see what's at the end that that guy missed out because he was too much of a pansy. Oh, he missed out on this. Yeah, I'm going to take that. But uh, first... Okay. Uh, dangerous moment here. It looks like I'll have to jump. Oh, I didn't... Oh, yeah, I have tags on. That's fine. Uh, oh, no, I'm lost again. Wait a second. Wait a second. I, I recognize this. Do I recognize this, or is this an optical loop? Yeah, no, I'm right here again. All right, all right. That's a long enough video. I feel like I've gone a little bit too long over 30 minutes, and I'm not going to fucking edit. I'm not going to fucking edit this video, all right? I'm not going to fucking edit this. I refuse to do it. Uh, but uh, anyway, yeah. Let's let's end at that uh, kick-ass neighborhood where, um, frankly, I am willing to buy some real estate. Please sell me the real estate of this goddamn place. This is so cool. I was going to play music in the background, uh, like I did with the last map. But no, this is... Uh... God, listen to it. That's so good. That's so good. So let's go ahead and end it here. Now, uh, I haven't actually checked how many likes I got the last time. I asked for one, and I think I got maybe 500% of that, which is pretty good. Let's up the ante, right? This time, I'm, I'm really going to drain you guys dry. I will make another one of these uh, exploration maps for Gary's Mod if I get um, uh, one and a half likes. One and a half likes. So it's going to average to one and a half. Yeah. Uh, and with that, I will talk to you guys later. Creep. Creepy ass thingy.